vai jogar Anciente com quatro jogadores. E a única coisa que o Yuri tem que fazer é ele nunca tá perto desses quatro. E outra, a única coisa que ele tem que fazer é, quando tiver uns 50, 45 segundos, ele fala, galera, deixa eu jogar primeiro aqui, ou calma, entra aí, espera eu jogar aqui. Pronto, testa, testa, duas Ancientes. Fala galera, beleza? Sejam bem-vindos a mais um vídeo. E no vídeo de hoje é os highlights, são os melhores momentos das partidas profissionais de CS. Caso você curte esse quadro aqui no canal, não se esquece, se inscreve aqui no canal, sua inscrição é muito importante para a evolução do mesmo aqui na plataforma. Seu like mostra para o YouTube que você curte demais esse estilo de conteúdo, fechou? Deixa de enrolação e vamos para o que importa, são os melhores momentos. Backing up towards the mid rotation with the smokes involved. The taps of ZTR will only do so much damage as the turn back in kind. Jaquino's Julie's domed in by Art. Nilo can't get one back. Needs to focus on that second player of Yuri. Sees that bomb carrier and doubles up. Uh, one of my favorite setups, the double Julie's, the double donut. Nilo getting away with heaps of impact. Fallen now being seen out towards mid, and Nilo's not even giving him an opportunity of a refrag. Double donut, triple kill. Adam B might get traded back here by Kesarato. Him and Fallen, though, have a hell of a task ahead of this two versus four, particularly with the bomb being dropped in the open at the Donut Control and all the Metasport rotating into the, the crossfire. They will not allow Fury to break in here without a hell of a task. Yeah, Fallen's just hoping to try and catch a good timing here onto ZTR. Get that first kill, look to put pressure on the back line. Oh, he's been spotted already. Does get the kill at least, but down to 36 points of health and with 40, it's going to be difficult to recover this. Only 35 seconds to go for the round itself anyway. They are taking their sweet time and Fallen's going for another wraparound in from the top mid control. This is a very slow approach. They might come down to the last few seconds and they might have to go for these last couple of kills. At least Adam B is low. That's a potential trade to a two versus two or one that should come easy. Second player has been seen as Sus picks up the Julies or picks up the pistol alongside the Julies to spray down Fallen. Serato can finally finish off Adam, but Metasport know that they've won the round. Just run away from this last player. He hasn't got time to plant the bomb. This is a pistol for the T side. And this actually might be Furia force buying in the next round just because of the economy state of Serato holding on. And they got a handful coming up, but you're right about their recent showings. Fast play again, rushing down this B-bomb side, looking for a bomb plant one more time. They will lose Cello as the forward man. Arts uh, aggressive, Mac 10 will be able to get a trade back, so Plant will be successful again. They're trying to see if they can trap these players off towards CT. Metasport might even have to go through red and come up towards shelf. They could get trapped behind this CT smoke for quite a while. The position's being checked. Nays to pop open the smoke. Yuri backed up. Tech 9 versus Adam B. Gets in. Mac 10 also rushes down with Yuri's follow up. Fallen can follow suit and R straight through the smoke. Can think a smoke also missed out there towards the donut entrance on the T side line. Bikino, his AWP does get flashed off position. And Adam will try and strike. Only the one for one. The AWP's also been seen. The smoke's come out. Nilo can make his move in. Actually, that smoke did drop. Actually, uh, got uh, the. What was it? Susp towards the, the back of the bomb side. And, and Adam B, like it's just you've got everything set. Quem aí não curte jogar aquele CS com os amigos, né? Mas chega de jogar sem skins, vem pro CSGO Fest, o site que mais te ajuda a ter sua primeira skin. Entrando pelo link da descrição, você está 100% seguro. Além de resgatar os 10% de bônus com o cupom Aleart, ganha uma caixa de graça e pega sua primeira skin para o seu inventário. Abraça essa oportunidade agora mesmo e não vacila. Play with, and even a Zeus out here for Adam. Missed out, dives out of the way. Mac 10 of Art does give chase. He's somehow still alive here, but he gets a kill off and fallen with the USB. I have no idea how that's worked, but there you go. One for one. Jaquino Zorp also posted. Can he get a frag? He's seen the utility coming up real close. He does find to Art, but Cello able to. That third man will not get called in until the very last second. These two defenders hold their nerve. Nilo way too exposed. Killed off by Yuri's quick spray. Suspend him into the smoke towards the CT entrance. Swings against Kesarato. Drops that bomb. Second player in the open in the AWP looking for an angle. I think he's seen him, but he backs off intelligently because the backstab's closing in. ZTR now up against Yuri, who's tapping that bomb, trying to force them out into fights. But seven seconds remain. He's going to have to overextend and Sust knows exact. Very defensive on B and a lack of util, so that's probably the reason why. Two to line up though for Sust. He's seen them both, only takes one pick for him. Molotov's going to force him forward into the hands of Cello. So it's a four versus four, but ZTR's expecting more. Aware that they're walking out of the K position as Cello makes a double happen. Swing back for the triple Nilo. Almost even gets fallen the same, but the Orc picks up the frag. It's 1v3 for Adam B. Considering the shelf angle. 
CZ, Cello caught dead to right. Ah, also taken aback. Adam B has got to escape though, because Fallen is going to find that trade. That calls in the backup though. All four players are going to get back here. And finally, Jakino hits some kill shots with Fallen getting the trade. Nilo's forced to respond back. And Yuri, other side of the map. No time, no bomb control. Harsher economy state with a Galil and a Mac 10. Still a number of rifles in the AWP in position for Jakino. Gets that first. Not quite that second. That's what Nilo's there for. For the double. And the swing back of the M4 of Adam B gives up the man advantage. Now Sus, low HP on Fallen, high HP of Kesarat has been removed. Right, that could be a serious amount of Fury of Hurt kills against Yuri and Art potentially if they group up. Oh, I'm going to get faced upon by Kesarat, who's part of things. He does get a kill on Adam B, but Sus is there to take him back, and that's an all-important kill to gain. Even the Orp is caught napping as Sus can double up, and now... 34 HP on the remaining Fury of players. Molotov's extending towards them. They can't afford to stick around in it. Nile's going to catch Art. Double up on Yuri. And Metasport will have the heart. Window might be a concern. But they will clear up the mid position. If Art gets anything out of this, it would be pretty special. But with utility in hand, Adam is going to find a pretty easy kill here. The footsteps up on the lane position. Finds Cello next up. Double up. Turn back in against the elbow controllers. Nilo has his back. Kesarato is isolated as he's fallen. And Furia now just completely fall apart. And Metasport are giving us a really good game. Showing us the goods. I mean, you could see with that crossfire out towards mid, pressuring elbow, pressuring the top of lane. Flashes in, only one player to defend against. A pretty deep smoke, and Cello's just going to get isolated and tomed in immediately. Blind taps, Yuri's going to take some damage, dish out a little bit more in return, but still a man advantage for Metasport. And this could be the round over already. That deep CT smoke's going to waste a lot of time, and you can see the way that as soon as that clears, they're going to take contact and from long instantly when the CTs come in. Well, deeper smoke back to run return. Nilo still close, turning away from the flashbang case right off. You get that kill, but Sus back in with one of his own. From behind the smokes, the T's will continue firing back. And Sus isn't done. Finally, he is without ammo in the. Prove themselves. And recover situation against Metasport. They do drop that first player. So that's a positive start for the Brazilians, but no one is on the A side. They're going to walk right in. It depends on how much space they're going to be able to take. They need to really recover this donut presence and put pressure onto Art. He's backed up. Bomb will cross. Molotovs are going to extend. Okay, Serato mows down one. Susp isn't quite ready for the SMG, so it's a 4v2 on the retake. And Nilo's still alive, and any time he is alive, something can happen. Nilo, desperate for this kill onto Art. Seeing the shadow. Art. I set. Footsteps known. He's checking left and right, trying to find these individuals. Now seen two, aware of the third player. Fourth man still unknown as of yet, but Nilo knows he needs to back up. He can't force the fight against all of them in this capacity. Giacchino also overwhelmed. And Fury. No smoke set. Arts incendiary going to try and drive them away. Caserato does find Nilo. Adam runs for the hills. Advantage Fury. Now this is tough now because there's no map control and time is starting to come down low. Burst up of art. Spray was not quite enough to do anything. Hello. Leans forward ahead of that flashbang of the T side. It only catches one player off, though. Cello will end up dropping, but Yuri still involved in this defensive. Sus has caught K. Serato on the long entrance. Art has fallen on the lurk towards mid. Metasport may be heavily tagged, but they have a man advantage, and they are just picking everybody up. In. With three SMGs and two M4s. Aggressive A main being watched out oh. here from ZTR. Jakino's already got that first kill. Now they can pressure the likes of Cello. Forced to use the smoke and block them off. He sticks around. He's a dead man walking. Yeah, this is uh, starting to turn into a bit of a one-sided affair. And they might even go hunting here. If they lose any of these guns, it's going to be a bad sign for Furia. Flashing against Fallen. Picks up one. Suspy's traded. Cello can double up. So they maintain the two M4s at least. Take three down overall on Metasport. They're still going hunting for them, though. Any overextend. So ready this B-Doors position. A smoke does come in. He's going to swing ahead of it dry, though. It's not going to see him. Spray's a bit awkward. There's three players surrounding him. One pick, not quite a second. And now that should send him. But Fallen has caught the main player walking right into the mid position where Nilo is ready for him. AK to go back towards red, though. Smoke in assistance. He's going to get right ahead of this. case. Serato is in danger as Nilo picks up the frag. A great timing on that flash. And now they could just start to squeeze out here towards A. Nilo's attention's brought over to the rotation from Cello. One player on A and not even on A directly. They know that Fallen's in Donuts. A legend himself stands alone, siphoned off from the rotating backup, but still trying to deal with Nilo. 
That bomb been seen. It's extending quite far out here. The Temple Arts also making its way into the bat line. So they are setting up a bit of a bracket. They've seen the shadows again. Plant will be secured. Cello making noise. Engaging Nilo. Still wins that fight. Fallen brings it into a two on two. As Argus to the center of the site. It's Giacchino alone versus them in the clutch. Tagged up by the crosses. Fallen out in the open. Adjusted towards. And Arts tagged up heavy. But he's not dead until now. 13 to 5. Mesport take their spot in the winner's match.